to the top of the lineup, and here is Aaron. Colin Mannon. Colin Mannon, uh, the leadoff hitter. Rounded out 4-3 to three his first time up, and Foreman takes second on the, on the ball that got away from the catcher, and that's in there for a cold strike. So they, everybody is batted now for Michigan as we see the leadoff hitter, the right-handed hitter. Bat with a runner at second and one out and a perfectly thrown pitch that time by Randy Enns. He could use another one, change up, and this one has popped up and the first baseman just in foul territory, about three or four feet in foul territory from the right of that first base bag, hauls it in. And Dave Bennett's done it again, two down. Zamarippa, the shortstop, singled and scored their only run, and he drives one foul. Boy, it gets really dark down that left field line. That's because the light standard is out, uh, kind of between the third base dugout and the bullpen area down the left field line, and that's a strike. Good pitch. Really pulling the string that time on Zamarella. And he's ahead 0-2. That one just a bit high. Change up, ground ball down the third baseline. It is foul. Byron Tate was all over that one. So another 0-2 pitch coming up to Zamarippa. Yep, that's his name. Z-A-M-A-R-I-P-P-A. Zamarippa. We're in the top of the third. Michigan drew first blood in the top of the first inning with an RBI double by their cleanup hitter, Kurt Postma. But then a three-run bottom half of the third inning as that pitch is swung on and fouled at the plate, and Zamarepa stays alive. Another 0-2 pitch, and that one a curveball just off the outside corner. Ends with the next pitch. And that's outside, and that is ball four. 